I'm hey. relieved to see you. Thanks for coming. Um, we're going to start by getting you to put on your PPE. Okay. Uh, I'm happy to read up the sign for you so that you take all the steps necessary. Okay, thank you. Thanks. Okay. Um, so, first, remove all jewelry, rings, watch, ID, stethoscope, pagers, cell phone, cloth hats. Step is uh, have hair tied back and secure. Uh, next step is hand hygiene. So 15 second hand rub with alcohol based hand rub. Ensure the entire surface of the hands are touched in between web of fingers, over thumbs and wrists. And when you are done that, you're going to don a yellow gown. Oh. Hey, so this the patient's really desaturating, isn't it? Yeah. Hi, Stephanie? Yes. I noticed the patient is desaturating. Yes. How much oxygen flow is she on? Okay, can you turn it up as high as it will go, please? Yes. Can we cycle the blood pressure cuff as well? Yes. Okay. Is she awake? Um, yes. Okay. I see her, I see her breathing, yeah. All right, let us know if she continues to deteriorate, please. Okay. We're coming in as fast as we can, okay? So, opening to the back, securing so tie the neck and waist, you've done that. Next step is the respirator. So, you've done your N95 respirator. Ensure that's the appropriate fit tested N95 respirator. Just make sure not to cross the straps. Bottom strap must rest below the ears. Really Top to strap above ears. Metal nose bridge must be adjusted in both hands. Seal check must be performed on sides, top, and bottom of respirator if chosen. The next step is the bouffant cap. Make sure it's pulled down close to the eyebrows. And the next step is to don eye protection. So that's a face shield with goggles. Position the facial over your face and adjust to fit comfortably. And the next step is to don gloves. Make sure the gloves are extended over the isolation gown and cuffs. After that, we'll do a final front and back check. Yeah, perfect. Incubation equipment. Is there a glide scope in the room? I can nope. go and get that. Could you get us the glide scope? Yeah. Okay. All right. Pranima, I see that there's some intubation and resuscitation medication here as well as airway equipment. I'm going to get you to style it this too. Okay. Do you want me to clean the spotter as much as possible? Here's the glide scope if someone wants to take it. Okay. I see that we have suction, we have a face mask. All right. We have a circuit set up in CO2 and a filter in line. Okay, so the patient is tachycardic, she is hypotensive, she is desaturating. I believe we are going to have to do a rapid piece of intubation with cricoid pressure, Stephanie. Do you know how to do cricoid pressure? Okay. We can anticipate that the patient will desaturate during this procedure. Okay, that's going to happen. So, Stephanie, I'm going to give you the intubation drugs, okay? Okay, okay. so I have ketamine and then have uh, rocket on the other Okay, great. Stephanie, I'm going to tell you when to push those, all right? Okay. Brittany, can you hand me the glide scope and the tube? Okay, so Thank here's the glide scope, and here's your other Thank you. Okay. okay. So the patient is not improving, in fact, she's deteriorating further. We also have some vapor testers available. Okay. Thank you. We're going to go ahead with the rapid sequence intubation. Okay. It's possible the patient may, I hear she is bloodying down right now. Uh, so can you please push the ketamine? Let's push 80 of ketamine. That's 8 cc's. 80 of ketamine and? Yeah, and let's push the entire syringe of rocuronium, please. Should be 150 milligrams. Blood pressure is 67 on 47. Pressure is 98. So let's just follow that with the please. Okay, me too. Karina, can you count to 30? Okay, 1, 2, 3. Push 2 cc's of that. 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 
10, 11, we have a crash cart available. 13, 14. All right, can you call a veteran for a crash cart? Can we get a crash cart, please? 18. I can bring you the crash cart. It'll take a moment. Thank you. She's so bright a party. We can't wait. I'm just going to check her job. She is soft. I believe we can intubate okay. safely. I'm going to remove the mask and we'll intubate. Okay? So you can drop the mask directly into the bin. Going ahead with the glide scope. I have a good view. Advancing to you. Slide it out, please. Let's have the top up first. All right, I visualize it in the glottis. Okay, I have the bag on, please. All right, can you bag me, Stephanie? Do we have CO2? Yes, you want to What are the vitals like? So blood pressure is 67, 147. Pressure is 42. Saturation is 66. All right, let's bag aggressively, please. We'll try to get her sats up. Let's have another 15 of a federal perineum. Can you come in and do that? Please? Okay, so I'm no longer going to be clean now. Okay. Yep. Okay, let's anticipate that we may need to perform compressions on the patient. Fifteen milligrams of the ephedrine are going in right now. Thank you. All right, so we have a patient with a secure airway. Sounds are coming up. Vitals are improving. Yeah. We have positive CO2. The airway is sealed. Okay. We're waiting for the blood pressure to cycle once more. All right. So what we're going to do for now is...